Hey you guys and welcome back to my channel. So it is a wear test Wednesday. I hope y'all are ready for this because I'm gonna look scary all day just for you guys. So let's go ahead and play the intro. Okay, so for today's wear test, I'm going to be testing out the Stila Stay All Day Liquid Lipstick Formula in the color Naughty, which is extremely, extremely dark, if you can't tell. I have worn this color once. I'm feeling dark and vampy today, so we are going to wear it again. Um, I have always been a big fan of the nudes in this formula, but the dark colors are what I'm super curious about because you know sometimes the formulas can be different. And on this channel, we try to test reds and super dark colors like this if we have them, uh, just to see how they fade off because dark colors can fade really horribly and that's never fun. So we are going to go ahead and apply this lippy see how it goes on and talk a little bit. Okay, so this lippy is so dark. Holy goodness. We're taking the lippy. We are putting it down. We are not taking it with us today. I really hope this performs okay because I got stuff to do today. But it felt nice. It's not sticky off the bat. Mm. I mean, so far, so good. What can I really say about it already, right? So we're going to go ahead and give you a time. It is Saturday, so I will be up a little bit later. It is right around 11 a.m. See if we can get y'all some focus. Okay, it's 11 a.m. ish. It's actually 11 11. Make a wish, guys. I know it's not 11 11 for you, probably, but it is for me. So, you know. Um, anyways, we are just gonna wear this probably till about midnight tonight. Oh, I hate when I have to stay up that late, but it's all right. It is Saturday. I am supposed to have fun today. Oh, fun. Okay, so we're going to wear this. We're going to see how it stays, how it fades. It is super dark, so if it fades, I'm not going to be mad, but we need to see if it fades in a flattering manner. So <laughs> that is it for now. I will be back. Probably around 3, 4 o'clock. I'll check in from my phone and let y'all know how this is working out. So, uh, just a second, guys. <laughs> hey, guys. Okay, so it is 2 o'clock. We are about 3 hours into our wear test. And so far, so good. The lipstick's holding up well. I had some popcorn chicken and mac and cheese. And something to drink earlier and it still really hasn't faded off no major issues which is really shocking for a color this dark um, still feels pretty good not dried down too bad a little bit of transfer around the edges but you know that's cuz I gotta overdraw these lips a little bit cuz we ain't got no lips so yeah so far so good definitely enjoying it I will check back in with y'all in a few more hours okay guys so it is time for the final check-in on this wear test it is 7 30 so we've had this on about eight hours i have somewhere to go that i can't be wearing a lipstick this dark so we got about an eight hour test in um as far as this lipstick goes let's zoom on in 
and the only issues I've had at all it is definitely a little bit like bleeding on the top lip not bad though just a little bit just through here and on the inner part it's of course faded down but past that for a lipstick that is pretty close to black this is actually like extremely impressive I always knew I loved their nudes but I'd never really tried their dark colors and uh, yeah these are good so these definitely get the stamp of approval from me I will definitely be probably getting more they're starting to hit TJ Maxx now I don't know if they're about to reformulate or if they're just getting rid of a few colors but you can find them at TJ Maxx a lot of the time I got mine for if it'll focus mine was $5.99 at TJ Maxx um, I think they retail for closer to 18 or 20 but if you can find them at TJ Maxx they usually have some really cute colors of course they have this dark color I've seen reds and a few nudes I'm sure they'll either get more or stop getting them at all I'm gonna be a toss-up but if you can find them there six dollars for this long wearing of a lipstick it's not bad and if you're used to paying you know closer to the $20 price range these are really good quality so that is it for today's wear test wednesday i hope y'all enjoyed and i will see you on friday bye you guys